Amlodipine is a commonly prescribed medication. It belongs to a class of drugs called calcium channel blockers. Doctors often prescribe amlodipine to treat high blood pressure. It can also help with chest pain, also known as angina. By relaxing blood vessels, amlodipine improves blood flow and lowers blood pressure. Amlodipine is generally safe for most people. However, it's crucial to be aware of potential interactions. Certain substances can interfere with amlodipine's effectiveness. They can even cause harmful side effects. Always follow your doctor's instructions carefully. Take amlodipine exactly as prescribed. Understanding the medication and potential interactions can help you stay safe and manage your health effectively. Drug interactions occur when a substance affects how a medication works in the body. These interactions can alter a drug's effectiveness. Sometimes they lead to unexpected and potentially dangerous side effects. When it comes to amlodipine, certain medications, foods, and even supplements can interfere with its mechanism of action. Some substances can increase amlodipine levels in the blood. This can lead to an overdose. Other substances might decrease its effectiveness, rendering the treatment inadequate. Understanding and avoiding potential drug interactions is vital for anyone taking amlodipine. This knowledge helps ensure the medication's safety and effectiveness in managing your health condition. Several medications can interact with amlodipine, a common medication used to treat high blood pressure and chest pain. Understanding these interactions is essential for maintaining your health and ensuring the effectiveness of your treatment. It's crucial to be aware of these potential interactions to avoid complications. Some interactions can lead to severe side effects, while others may reduce the effectiveness of your medication, putting your health at risk. Combining amlodipine with certain antidepressants like MAOIs can lead to dangerously low blood pressure. This can cause symptoms such as dizziness, fainting, and even shock in severe cases. Always inform your doctor about all the medications you are taking, including over-the-counter drugs and herbal supplements. This helps your healthcare provider make informed decisions about your treatment plan and avoid harmful interactions. Avoid taking medications like alprazolam, also known as Xanax, with amlodipine. This combination can lead to increased sedation, making it dangerous to perform tasks that require alertness, such as driving. This combination can lead to increased sedation and even respiratory problems. In severe cases, it can cause difficulty breathing, which can be life-threatening if not addressed promptly. Similarly, phenobarbital, a medication used to treat seizures, can reduce amlodipine levels in the blood, making it less effective in controlling your condition. This can result in uncontrolled blood pressure or chest pain. Remember, this is not an exhaustive list. There are many other medications that can interact with amlodipine, including some antibiotics, antifungals, and other blood pressure medications. Always consult your doctor or pharmacist before starting any new medication while on amlodipine. They can provide you with the most accurate and personalized advice to keep you safe and healthy. Statins are another class of drugs often prescribed to lower cholesterol levels. While both statins and amlodipine are beneficial for heart health, combining them can increase the risk of muscle-related side effects. This risk is especially high with statins like simvastatin and levastatin. These medications can amplify the risk of muscle pain, weakness, and a serious condition called rhabdomyolysis. Rhabdomyolysis is a breakdown of muscle tissue that can lead to kidney damage. If you need to take both amlodipine and a statin, your doctor might adjust the dosages or recommend a different type of statin to minimize the risk of these side effects. Section 5. Antifungals and Antibiotics. Proceed with caution. Be cautious when taking antifungals or certain antibiotics alongside amlodipine. Some antifungals, like itraconazole and ketoconazole, can significantly increase amlodipine levels in the blood. This can lead to a higher risk of side effects, including low blood pressure, dizziness, and swelling. Similarly, some antibiotics, including erythromycin and clarithromycin, can also interact with amlodipine. This interaction can be particularly concerning for older adults, who might be more susceptible to drug interactions. Always inform your doctor if you are prescribed antibiotics while on amlodipine. They can monitor you closely for any potential adverse reactions. Section 6. The Impact of Food and Supplements on Amlodipine It's not just medications that can interact with amlodipine. The foods you eat and the supplements you take can also play a significant role in how this medication works in your body. 
Understanding these interactions is crucial for managing your health effectively. Certain foods and supplements can also affect how your body processes this medication. When you consume different foods or take various supplements, they can either enhance or inhibit the absorption and effectiveness of amlodipine. For instance, grapefruit and its juice can increase the amount of amlodipine absorbed by your body. This means that more of the drug enters your bloodstream, potentially leading to stronger effects than intended. This interaction can amplify the drug's effects and increase the risk of side effects. Common side effects of amlodipine include swelling, dizziness, and a rapid heartbeat. When these effects are intensified, they can become more problematic and uncomfortable. Therefore, it is advisable to limit or avoid grapefruit consumption while taking amlodipine to prevent any potential issues. This simple dietary adjustment can help you maintain the right balance of the medication in your system. Additionally, be cautious about supplements. Not all supplements are safe to take with amlodipine, and some can cause adverse interactions. St. John's wort, often used for mood support, can interfere with amlodipine's effectiveness. This herb can reduce the concentration of amlodipine in your blood, making it less effective at controlling your blood pressure. Always discuss any herbal supplements you are taking with your doctor to ensure they are safe to use alongside your prescribed medications. Your healthcare provider can help you navigate these interactions and suggest alternatives if necessary. By being informed and proactive, you can better manage your health and the effectiveness of your treatment. Section 7. Recognizing the Symptoms of Excessive Amlodipine Exposure While amlodipine is generally safe when taken as directed, it's vital to be aware of the symptoms of potential overdose or excessive exposure. Amlodipine is a medication used to treat high blood pressure and angina, and it works by relaxing the blood vessels so that blood can flow more easily. However, like any medication, taking too much can lead to adverse effects. Understanding these symptoms can help you act quickly and seek medical attention if necessary. Recognizing these symptoms early allows for prompt medical attention, which can prevent serious complications. If you experience dizziness, lightheadedness, or fainting, especially after standing up too quickly, it could be a sign of low blood pressure due to excessive amlodipine. These symptoms occur because the medication can cause your blood pressure to drop too much, leading to insufficient blood flow to your brain. Another symptom to watch out for is swelling in your legs or ankles, also known as edema. This can happen because amlodipine can cause your body to retain too much fluid. Edema can be uncomfortable and may indicate that your body is not handling the medication well. It's important to monitor any changes in your body and take note of any new or worsening symptoms. In addition to dizziness and swelling, other symptoms of excessive amlodipine exposure can include rapid heartbeats, chest pain, and shortness of breath. These symptoms can be more serious and may require immediate medical attention. If you experience any of these, do not hesitate to contact your healthcare provider. If you notice any of these symptoms, contact your doctor immediately. It's always better to be cautious and get checked out by a professional. Your doctor can provide guidance on how to manage your symptoms and adjust your medication if necessary. Remember, your health and well-being are the top priority, so don't ignore any warning signs your body may be giving you. Section 8. The Importance of Consulting Your Healthcare Provider Open communication with your healthcare provider is paramount when taking any medication, especially amlodipine. Your doctor can provide personalized guidance based on your medical history, current medications, and lifestyle. Never hesitate to ask your doctor or pharmacist any questions you might have about amlodipine. This includes concerns about potential drug interactions, side effects, or any other medication-related queries. Remember, your healthcare provider is your partner in managing your health. Section 9. Prioritizing Open Communication for Safe Medication Use in conclusion, amlodipine is an effective medication for managing high blood pressure and other cardiovascular conditions. However, it's crucial to be aware of the potential interactions it can have with other substances. By being informed about the medications, foods, and supplements to avoid, you can minimize the risk of adverse effects. Remember to inform your healthcare provider about all the medications and supplements you are taking. They can provide personalized advice and adjust your treatment plan if needed. By prioritizing open communication and informed decision-making, you can ensure the safe and effective use of amlodipine in managing your health condition.